It's the Tank Engine and Friends. Wooden Railway Episodes. Episode 20, The Mystery. Percy had picked some engines to help him. He'd, he could not pick Thomas and Toby as Thomas and Toby were helping him with his work. So, he picked some engines that weren't as busy. Duck, Oliver, and Charlie. Stop and Hat came up. Well, Percy, I've seen you pick the engines that you wanted, that you wanted to ha have help with. Yes. Alright. I need uh, two engines to go tonight. Duck and Oliver, will you go tonight? Yes, sir. And Percy and Charlie, you will go tomorrow night. Alright. And they puffed away. That night, Duck and Oliver went around the island patrolling. I haven't seen anything yet. Me either. Ha ha ha, so gullible. Next morning, Duck and Oliver, Percy and Charlie returned and Stopham Hat arrived. Did you see anything last night, Stopham Hat? No, sir, they said. We didn't see anything. We patrolled around the whole island. Well, Percy and Charlie, you will have to do tonight's shift. All right. Get ready for tonight. So Top and Pat stepped away as the engines puffed off. That night, Percy and Charlie were patrolling the island. Percy came to Nafford Station, <laughs> totally empty. He was about to puff away when he looked down the line. There were Diesel, Larry, and Bert. What are they doing, so Percy? All right, guys, think of me as the boss around here. Yes. Well, this other guy who's been hiding on the island for months. Oh, you think of me as the boss? This guy's the real boss. Who? Well, well, you haven't met him yet, but you're about to meet him. I got in contact with him. Well, not exactly with him. The reason that I met him is because of one of his followers. I thought we would need help to do this. Yes, this plan's genius, they said. But technically, our little contract says he owns some of the island and I own the rest of it. All right. Percy heard this. What? Wait a minute. What? He said he... Huh. This plan of yours, Diesel, was so brilliant. Sorry, and Bert. I know. We can finally get those steenies back for everything they've done. <laughs> but we tried taking over the island many, many times before. It hasn't worked. I know, but this time it's going to work. Have you seen how many engines crashed? Yeah. <laughs> Oil comes in handy, doesn't it? Yeah. <gasps> it's a Percy. Oh. It, it was them. <gasps> he scurried away to find Charlie as fast as he could. Percy had puffed in at Fort Station, and he had soon found Charlie in a siding. Charlie! Charlie! What, Percy? I overheard a Diesel's conversation. Who? Well, Diesel, Ari, and Bert's conversation. I overheard their conversation, and, well, this, I think they're behind this whole crashed engine thing. How would they be behind this whole thing? They were probably only behind the latest accents. Eh, yeah, you're right. Anyways, I bet the first, like, the first few are maybe, well, a lot of the first ones, maybe those were just... Mm, I don't know. They just happened. Yeah. They kind of caused all of those. Because that's just... I don't think Diesel and his crew could have caused all those, Charlie. It's probably nothing. Let's tell us the top of hat. Alright. And they puffed away their sheds. They were going to tell us the top of hat what Percy had seen the next morning.